Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? Hope everybody's having themselves a fantastic day. It's Wednesday, hump day. At least I think it's Wednesday. Let me just, uh... Yeah, Wednesday. <laughs> hey, no, how you doing? Hey, Spiderette, welcome. Welcome, welcome to stream, folks. So, uh, I know that I said we'd probably be doing Sengoku Dynasty unless I found something else. Well, found something else. <laughs> we got Garage Flipper going on. Now, this is uh, the playtest of the demo, so I don't know how much content is going to be in there and that but uh when that came up in my email i was like hey we got to do this karsten hey yo how are you doing hey 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 hope you're having yourself a wonderful day so far my friends uh, and your evenings as well no matter where you are in the world today as always let's do the blurb don't forget to like comment subscribe hit that notification bell and if you're in the live streams make sure that you check off the uh, uh, gifted membership section there so here's anybody who gifts some memberships in here you are in the running to get one so that is fantastic to everybody who's been joining in, boosting up the GG's channel. Thank you so very much. We are almost, we are almost at uh, 2,500. I think we need about another 35 more subs. So if you're just catching me for the first time there, welcome. And uh, I hope that you hit the subscribe button. Now that the blurb's over, <laughs> I uh, had myself a pretty good night last night. Uh, unfortunately, yeah, it's Wednesday. Definitely, Jack. Yep, definitely. Um, so, yeah, Tony called me last night. Unfortunately, uh, his wife and son uh, came down with a bit of a cold, so I will not be going out this weekend to give them a hand to <laughs> pull out the uh, raised garden bed that they have right now and replace it with uh, the new ones. So, my weekend is free, so I will probably be streaming unless something pops up. So, look forward to hanging out with you all on the weekends. So, if you got the time, I'll see you guys there if I'm if I'm capable and able, which I should hope so. So, uh, no guarantees on what time I'm going to stream, but uh, we will be streaming. And oh yes, we do have some more mail that came in, folks. So you guys got to both. Oh, the uh, how many seconds we got? Oh, geez, 35 seconds left. Get your drinks, get your snacks, get your butts in the comfiest positions, and get back relaxed, unwind, and enjoy today's show. <laughs> so we'll do the mail about anywhere from like 15 minutes to half an hour in. We'll do a quick little segment on that. Uh, pretty easy one today. It didn't come in a brown box, so uh, it's going to be just a quick hit and get. Actually, you know what? We'll do that right now. Let's do student mail call while we're in the ten last 10 seconds. Right? <laughs> so it is. Oh, it didn't come in a box. came as is. I won't show the other side because it's got my address on it. But it is a replacement keyboard. So thank you, thank you, thank you to the members of the community that came forward with the to my rescue. So I'm not using this wireless one anymore this wireless keyboard it it's it's slow uh I'll, I'll i'll take a i'll press the d key and it won't work like so say I, so say i go to type in definitely i'll go def and then it'll be ef will pop up on screen it will take the d at the very beginning it's just drives you nuts derek how you doing how you doing you guys ready i'm ready let's jump into the game now i, I have no idea what's going on here we're going to have to figure out the sounds and everything here let's just turn the music down just a little bit there we go yeah so uh, we're going in completely blind so let's just get the music on pause for a minute just in case there's an intro and let's see what's going on i do like the art style on this it reminds me um a lot of that uh, woodworking simulator i'm pressing any key to continue uh-oh uh-oh Uh, let's put some music on while we wait. Um, pressing any key to continue. I'm getting nothing. Right, can I, I can type, right? <laughs> Let me just come over here. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. I can type. It's not the keyboard that's dead. Hmm. Oh, oh. There we go. Ha ha! It should say loading. We should have a loading mechanism on there so that doesn't happen. Just a word to the devs. Uh, you can move the camera by using your mouse. Use the WASD keys to move around. Press shift during walking to run. Okay. Uh, jump, space button. Whee! Uh, press and hold the middle mouse button to activate the tools menu. Cool. Okay. With the hand tool selected, you can pick up and move objects. Press and hold the right. Move an object. Oh, okay, I'm not sure. Uh, let's do this. Thank 
Okay. Uh, you can rotate the object you're holding by spinning and catch that. Press tab to turn on the tablet. There you go. You can use the tablet to improve your stats, buy things, look for new orders, and sell valuable things at the auction. My goodness, this stuff is just flying through here, so... Hey, Jeremy! Uh, to make your first order, you need to open the tablet, and under the All Orders tab, you can accept the available order. Okay. Um, all orders have a certain budget. Shuffle and description with the budget. You can buy the necessary things for the execution of the order. You cannot exceed the budget of the order, though. Okay. So we have a budget of 9000 but we're only going to pay 3000 So, hmm, interesting. An old litter garage. It was used to store old things. The garage has been flooded several times, and this is in a terrible state. We want to get rid of all the old stuff, clean it up, and paint the walls and hang shelves. All right, so put furniture on floor, clean dust, paint walls, and polish the walls. Oh, polish the walls, and throw away the garbage. Okay. Let's do this. Let's see how long this loading screen takes. Uh oh, I gotta blow my schnoz. One sec. Love it. What's well, not the sneezing? It's the, uh, oh, whatchamacallit. Sinuses. Oi. All right, now that the camera's off, I can turn that light off while we wait for this loading screen. Hold on. That's interesting. So you select the grinder tool and use it to smooth the wall surface. Then equip the roller tool and apply your chosen paint color evenly across the wall. If necessary, use the spatula tool to make adjustments or remove excess paint until you're satisfied. All right. Hold on. I can already tell you right now. Uh, okay. The birds are a little loud. Let's go over here and turn that down a bit. There we go. That should work. <coughs> Excuse me. In the upper left corner of the screen, there are order tasks. They need to be fulfilled to complete the order. Okay. Uh, while holding the furniture, drop it close to the player on the ground to place it. Okay. In addition to making tasks, you can buy the additional ambient items and change the interior at your own request. Okay. All right. Let's just see here. Uh, use the dumpster to throw away the garbage. Uh, to take the garbage in your hand and throw it away, you use the hand tool and while holding the RPM, take the trash and throw it in the trash container. Okay. Uh, sometimes antiques can be found in blue. Antiques can be placed in your garage or sold at an auction. Some things can cost a lot of money, okay? Use the ET to collect antiques and place them in inventory. All right, um... Are you seeing an issue here? It says throw it in the trash can. No, I can't jump out this way. There's no trash can over here. Supposed to throw it in here? This doesn't make any sense. I don't know what's going on. You know what? We'll just put everything out here for now. Yeah, it wouldn't be the first time, Jack, that, uh, you know, I fired up a game and uh, found something at the very beginning to break it. <laughs> it won't be the last. Oh, an antique. There we go. Found our first antique. We're into the antiquities. Dominoes! Hey, I like those physics right on. Right on. Okay, all the dirt and dust on the floor can be cleaned up using the vacuum tools. Yeah, that makes sense. So, this is red. And, yeah, it just... It, Oh, open and close dump. Um, well, 
Just got to get a little bit up close, I guess. There we go. Okay, we got it figured. We got this. Oh, that was cool. It made the dust and everything. All right, so it does make it disappear. Good. Okay. No idea what this is. Looks like a... <laughs> I don't know what that looks like. like. Maybe a cushion, a foam cushion or something? Uh, let's see, in the options, there was no way to toggle the runs or anything. I'd like to... I'd prefer to see a toggle. Instead of pressing and holding the shift, I'd like to be able to toggle the shift. I'm guessing anything that's in red is to go to the trash. I'm guessing. Oh, come on. Come on now. Ah. <laughs> it's a little off, but I mean, this is the play test of the demo. So I'm glad that companies are doing that at least now, getting the, the demos play tested. So that way when they do release of the prologue slash demos, whatever you want to call it in this day and age, like UFO, UAP, um, basically they'll have a much better product. <laughs> I love how the dust just keeps popping up. Fortunately, trash can, uh, can ran off after spouting legs when the prime minister was thrown into it. <laughs> Yeah, he's getting himself into a lot of trouble lately. All right, let's press and hold it. Let's go to the vacuum. All right, so that animation can do with a little bit of work. Uh, you can buy multiple products at a time. Pa uh, 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 we gotta polish the walls. All right. Interesting. During the execution of the order, you can buy things in the store for budget. In the player's garage, you can make purchases with your own money. All right. Press the LPM to use the concrete grinder tool. You can sand the wall to further color it to the color of your choice. Interesting. Okay, so you uh, you can do half. Uh, it's not like it's not a all or nothing type of thing here. That's pretty cool. Oh, look at that! We're creating dust. Oh, well done, devs. Well done indeed. I'm like, what's going on here? Why does it say I have to uh, clean all the dust again? Little Mac is here, hey, buddy. On a day off, even. Nice. Jump over and grab the... Uh, uh, follow the link down in the description below there. Get yourself in the playtest. I don't know if they're still accepting people or not, but uh, if you're interested in it, guys, that's where all the information is down in the description below. As always, you know, got to keep that basement full. Let's throw some food down there every once in a while. Keep it fed. Food for thought. How you doing, little Mac? Man, if you're getting a day off in the middle of the week, that means you're working the weekend. Poor bastard. I feel for you, little Mac. Now, I'd like to see that these... Uh, what's the word I'm uh, looking at? Uh, instead of using the right mouse button, I wish there was a, a hot key for it as well. So, like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero. So I'll be the hot key for this one. Doing good. Glad to hear it, my man. Glad to hear it, as always. This is clean up all the dust. Where's the rest of the dust? There we go. Now, let's go over to the tab key, and we need to shop for some paint. Let's see here. Uh, are these the colors we get to work with? Well... Let's 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 just just go with gray. Oh, whoops! Uh, paint the wall in a selected color. Okay. 
doesn't show me the selected color. Alright. Oh, and there's our paint. Oops. Uh, grab the hand. Uh, interesting. It's not letting me grab it. Do I have to do it from here? Click to pick up paint. I am clicking to pick up paint. Uh, come on. Mm, nothing's working here. Uh, let's try going back to the hand. Talk to the hand. Friday off as well? Ow. There we go. Now, can I open the lid? No, open lid. Okay. Press the left mouse button on the paint can to select the desired color while holding left mouse button. Paint the wall on the selected color. All right. Aha, the spatula tool is used to scrape the paint off the wall. Just select the spatula tool and hold down left mouse button to remove the paint from the wall. Okay. Interesting. I wonder how many uh, how many of these wall sections we can get done. I can see if they have like an upgrade thing going on that you know you can do like more than one slice at a time. First it'll be like two, then three, then four, then five, then the entire wall. That'd be great. It'd be nice if you could select between them as well, so that way if you want to do like a like a stripe pattern, you don't have to go back afterwards and do the uh, spatula. Uh, do I need more paint? Yep, that's what it was. I needed more paint. Need a, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? We need, um, a fill amount indicator. How much paint is on your paint roll? This is looking all right. I like the graphics of the game. I like it. Definitely another Unity engine game. Did anybody else notice that very first garage that we were going through that was like such a panic to read all the tutorial information with? Anybody else notice that it uh, really looked like Junkyard? Um, the garage from Junkyard? What's going on here? Why are you no paint no more? You're supposed to be telling me you're empty? Hmm. I think we ran out of paint. I think that's what it's trying to tell me. Yep, must have run it out of painted. It says $30, but it doesn't say like how much you can use on it. So hmm. that'd be something that they could uh, work on. Let's just take a look inside this one. Oh yeah, so yeah, there is paint in this. Okay, I see. There is a fill level. But uh, that lid needs to be completely removed once you set it down somewhere. Or a way for us to remove the lid so we can see exactly how much paint is in there. I threw me for a loop. Threw me for a loop. Uh, I'm just wondering if I should throw in some menthol gum to clean up my sinuses a little bit. That eh, I think we'll be all right. Yeah, see, now we got paint on the roller. I see what's going on. But I would like to see, uh, like I said, like an indicator for full level. But even if it's just on the handle of the roller itself, just a, a little line that, you know, shows you like, oh, you're one third, two thirds, you know, empty. So that is paint all the walls done. Sweet. Now let's just put that over here for the moment. Maybe we can sell that back. I don't know.
Mm. Yep, typical Unity engine. That's a, cuts into all the uh, Eclipse pretty good. Doing even Stevens here. Uh, not quite. Good enough. Wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. On the floor. Get on the floor. All right. Okay. Throw away all the garbage. Put the furniture on the floor. Clean all the dust. Paint the walls of any color. Polish the walls. Throw away the garbage. Uh, I think we've done it. Uh, game. sure if there's supposed to be anything else happening after this let's go tab uh auction oh, can't do auction stats aha oh you receive a 20 percent boost to movement speed you grind 20 percent faster you vacuum 20 percent faster oh i don't know if that means that we highlight these or, or what but uh, we'll take those all right you know what we're just going to put this in the back of the pickup. Don't, don't spill. Don't spill. Jeez. All right. So let's go over here. Go to the order. There we go. Okay. So you're going to the order to finish it. So let's do that. Let's go to finish. An old dinner's garage was used to store old things. The garage has been flooded several times and is in a terrible state. We want to get rid of all the old stuff. Clean it up. Paint the walls and hang shelves. Done. Garage renovation in a family house. $3,000. You want to finish the order? Yes, please. Hey gamers, thanks a ton for playing Garage Flipper Demo. Your support is incredible. Your feedback is pure gold, helping us make the game even better. Stay tuned on our socials and websites for updates. Your support means everything. Thanks for being a part of our crew. Okay, so I wasn't expecting it to be that quick of a game. Wow. Um, huh. Well, glad to hear that you you got the, the play test going on, but it was pretty quick. Pretty quick indeed. Um... Yeah, so like let's go back into the settings here that we couldn't do earlier. So sound effects, you probably want to turn those down. The birds are pretty loud. All right, so game-wise though, graphics, these are pretty much all the um all the options that we have at the moment. So they're really not very much. So your game. I mean, you can't even change it from, you know, like uh, quality density, you know, like from low, medium, high. So uh, this is the play test, though. As you can see, uh, I did have a little bit of feedback for them on that. Um, wow. I'm just kind of surprised at how quick we went through that. That was uh, that was crazy. Can you cheap? Can you be the cheap window licker? <laughs> I can't believe it. We finished it already. Let's let's uh, let's let's do a, try another new one here. <laughs> let's do it twice. <laughs> I can't let you guys go. Uh, not even a thirty-minute stream. Good stream, y'all. Catch you later. Yeah, no, no, I'll do it one more time just to see. You know, we're not going to try speed running it, but now that we know what's going on, see if we can uh, uh, what we can do here. So. Hmm. But thanks again uh, for the keyboard there, folks. You guys are awesome and amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Greatly appreciate that. Like I said, that gets uh, I can put this my spare keyboard away, my wireless one. So, and uh, I'll be able to type instantaneously again. Oh, that'll be so much nicer. I heard uh, you're starting your own business. That's awesome. Install a virtual assistant on your phone and help you understand. This is moving way too fast. You can move the camera by using the mouse. You can WASD it. You can press Shift to walk or run jump on all that stuff but yeah let's just take a look around here does this not look like the same garage that was in junkyard uh... yeah this is the exact same garage but they've just put different furniture like it's the garage model itself 
So I remember this pipe because I'm trying to put down cases of beer. <laughs> um, I don't think the sink was there though. Then they had like a display cabinet over here and that, so. Yeah. This is exactly that same model. Shane coming in with five gifted memberships. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, make sure that if you're in the live stream or you're new to the channel, uh, click on the uh, accept gifted memberships because things like this happen all the time. Thank you so very much, uh, Shane. You are awesome and amazing. A huge man with a huge heart. So welcome, Osni, Vidi, Bastardin, Bashadin, Bashadin. I will just call you Beatrix. Uh, Lit and William. So one, two, three. Four, five. Welcome, welcome. Well, uh, so now we have three Williams in our uh, our members. So that is awesome. Bring on the Williams. Hey, Beans, how you doing? How are you doing? I'm doing really, really well. Thank you once again, Shane. Uh, everybody in chat, leave your favorite dish, 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 emoji. Oh, here come the the gifted memberships. Oh, interesting that's a new logo i've never seen that before that's the one we're looking at there we go <laughs> yeah leave your favorite emojis folks See all those members you know what to do show them some gargoyle love ah thank you so much shane for being a big supporter of the channel thank you thank you thank you greatly appreciate that Ooh, i got spoiled today absolutely you guys are awesome and amazing thank you I'm spoiled this week <laughs> Oh, man, you're making me blush. I'm glad the camera isn't on. I'd look like a uh, except gifted sons. Click the money icon. Click join membership. Then click the three dots and turn on gifted subscriptions. Reaper coming in with 20 memberships. Well, uh oh, I'm going to have to work on my my final uh, roll call. So demonic lemon. Welcome. Joshua Rock. OK, Basta. Abigail Perry. Jesse Haugen. Uh, Annie is Satria, just a girl who loves films. Lee and Mandy Battersby, and two times Hunt, Salvador Cobian, CX5, Trisha Wahoo, Timeless Boss, uh, Govin Singh, welcome, <laughs> Stole Shaw, Bolt of Poppet, Sung Han, Geert QT. Uh, Martin Anderson. Oh, welcome. Welcome. Welcome every single one of you guys. Once again, let's leave our favorite emojis down in chat for our uh, gifted members between Shane and um, uh, Reaper here. I think we just doubled the amount of memberships that we have on the channel. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Greatly appreciate that. Well, that is that is awesome. I'm definitely going to have to uh, fix the uh, end credits. That's for sure. Oh, and so the one of the garage models was used in the Phasmophobia as well. Oh, there we go. I did not know that. Press hold the middle belt button, okay. With the hand tool selected, you can create, move as well, uh, pick up the objects, okay. Press and hold the right mouse button. You can rotate, gotcha. So you just go like that, and then you can rotate using your mouse wheel. Then use tab. Improve your stats, buy things. So we got, let's do this. I love these. I love the, oh, I'm pointing up to the, <laughs> to the notifications, but you guys can't see me playing. I've been doing good beans. Glad to hear it, man. Glad to hear it. Sorry to hear that you're in there, but I'm glad that you're out. That's for sure. That's right. K-Man plus Dr. Pepper equals <laughs> pow. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's how true is that? Absolutely. Man. And so now you know, ladies and gentlemen, why I happen to pop by every once in a while or pop in with that little blurb there. You know, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. And if you're in the live stream, make sure that you click that dollar icon so you can get yourself a gifted membership when they come rolling through. I've had a couple of times when our gifted memberships have gone to nobody because we didn't, uh, we ran out of people watching. <laughs> so. <laughs> so this is pretty awesome. I'm really liking the amount of detail that they're adding into just like even this little tutorial area. Uh, I would like to see that maybe you press enter after every single one of those little tutorial things up there and maybe a skip all button as well for it uh, for when you do the replays. But other than that though, this garage is my sanctuary. <laughs> Uh, oh my jeez, jeez, man, that, that sucks. You know, hopefully it was, hopefully it was, hopefully there was no, uh, 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 no cheating bastards going on somewhere in that one. Hopefully not. 
uh, the, yeah, the, so this, like I said, this is looking pretty good. I like how they put as much stuff in here as they have. They could have gone and gotten more uh, Unity assets, but they didn't. They kept it uh, pretty much down to what you'd see in like a home garage, except for this giant dumpster. <laughs> That's all right. All right, let's go over here to the order. Let's try it again. Still surprised you're a mod? Yeah, well, I mean, you haven't done anything to piss me off, so why would I get rid of it, right? Damn straight, my man. I'm afraid you were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. Okay, I think that was the last one. I think. I'm afraid nope. you were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. Oh, okay, I see, I see. We got, uh... Uh, a, a few more to go through. <laughs> I'm afraid you were just in the there we go. All right. Select the grinder tool. Use a small. Yeah, okay. Time. We know all this stuff now. So yeah, the pressing that uh, enter is a great way to um, allow the player to dictate when and how they want to, uh, and how fast they have to be able to read. There's some people out there who've got visual issues. You know, reading small words or things that go by that fast, that type of stuff, doesn't work out best for them. So I'd like to see that's either slowed down or an option to dismiss. I'm afraid you were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. So we got the antique. Now there's no throw um, feature either, which would kind of be nice. I'm afraid Try to see if you can score basketballs, but you'd have to have like this up against the wall so it hits the wall and then bounce forward. So that way it doesn't go out of zone, out of bounds. I'm afraid you were just in the wrong place. At the wrong time. <laughs> Excuse me. I do apologize. I seem to be catching a, a tickle in my throat today. And I have a sneeze coming as well. Ah, what is with me and the sneezing lately? Between spring and fall, I tell you, I wake up every morning and it's like, am I getting sick? And then by like, you know, mid-afternoon, it's like, all gone. Like, uh, allergies. Oh, man. I thought I got rid of those when I was a kid. And poor Captain Caveman, he's just getting them now as well. He's, he's starting his allergies. Uh, I got him early on, not this last Friday, but the Friday before, because uh, the school thought he was sick, and we were like, uh, I don't think he's sick. If he's not running a fever or anything, um, he probably isn't sick. He probably just has allergies, but they still had to send him home, so he's got some uh, uh, allergy meds now, so that way the school doesn't send him home. God, they're so panicky ever since the, uh, the vid thing happened, I tell you. All it took to make a little bit of pan uh, uh, panic was a pandemic, I guess. I remember going to school and there'd be at least two or three kids sitting there, you know, dripping from their nose and all that stuff. Not anymore. Now they're dripping at the nose. It's off to the nurse's office. I mean, poor kids these days. I mean, yeah, they're not allowed to climb trees anymore. Um, I heard something about something going on in France about anti-bullying laws. Like, that's getting pretty crazy. But I guess my generation was the last of the feral children, I guess. Now, why did I just go and vacuum that up when I know I'm going to need to vacuum it again after we polish up these walls? Uh, no, he's still with his mom at this point in time. I'm having a bit of an issue. i um, trying to get onto the government's, um, uh, the, the uh, permanent disability type of thing. And they make it damn near impossible, man. So, there's a couple things that I got to, uh, I got to wait for appointments for to get done and checked out on in order for them to accept my claim. They have acknowledged, yes, that I have done all this testing and everything else before, but due to the fact that my doctor's logs uh, are have been destroyed, um, that they don't have access to those logs. All they have is they can see how all the treatments have changed afterwards, after I went and saw 
you know, like a specialist, a rheumatoid specialist and stuff like that, or um, an endocrinologist. That was the big one. The, a big change happened after the endocrinologist because that's when they found that I'm producing a ton of adrenaline all the time. And my heart rate and blood pressure are just like through the roof always. And so at first they started off with like heart meds, right? And the heart meds, I mean, once they got me up the complete full dose for my body weight, um, and it was making a dent at all. So then they're like, oh, okay, well, you know, it's probably, you know, something uh, to do with your uh, adrenal glands. So then they went and checked that and they're like, oh yeah, definitely. Your adrenal glands are like really pumping out. Uh, maybe, you know, figure out what was causing that. So then they put me on pain medications and that started actually helping the, uh, the, the blood pressure and stuff like that. So then they got me up to maximum doses on pain meds. And I tell you, I'm not a fan of the morphine patches guys. It's that stuff is rude. Uh, it's not very nice at all. Did not like having that in my body all the time, but it wasn't, it wasn't even enough at maximum doses to knock out 30% uh, like a decrease in my my vitals right so so wasn't working so good then we started doing um, the cannabis treatments and that really started helping out but unfortunately the government will not pay for medical um, cannabis unless you're on permanent disability I'm on temporary disability right now even though i have a permanent disability <laughs> but yeah so i'm just having to go through hoops what can you do right what can you do yeah man still still having to deal with it beans still having to deal with it that's okay i'm a strong character and strong mind i mean if i hadn't by now i mean the amount of pain that uh my body registers on a daily basis is pretty crazy. Like right now, I'm I'm uh, I'm living with two torn rotator cuffs that have a bursitis and arthritis flare-ups at the same time, and I'm still ticking. The only thing I'm not doing is I'm not mowing the lawn. I can't do it. I cannot hit the pull start on the whipper snipper or the actual lawnmower itself. I try, and uh, my arm becomes useless. Like just burning, screaming pain. No, and then I can't move it for like 10 minutes. It's like I can't have a lawnmower running for 10 minutes <laughs> without me being able to push it because I'm screaming all the George Carlin profanities in the world. Like I said, he'd be impressed. He'd be impressed. Hey, it's what it is, right? It's just life. And that's the way I look at it. It's, you know, it's life. You know, things happen in life that you can't control and just, just happens to be one of them for me. So, yeah. Just live with it, right? You can do your usual complaints, just don't dwell on them, right? You know what I mean? You can sit there and go, yeah, damn it, why the hell is it always gotta happen to me? But you know, as long as you're not dwelling on it, it's all good. And it's the dwelling on it that uh, that gets a lot of people. I'm not one of those sorts. I still go out and do do my things the best that I can. Whoa! I say, the table saw your proposal and rejected you. <laughs> But no, not gonna have that happen. Uh uh. You ain't sitting there. But yeah, so far, I'm enjoying the game. I can see a few things that need to be uh, worked on, but I mean, once again, this is a super uh, early access, so, you know, changes are bound to happen. Or, surly, uh, sorry, uh, this is the play test for the demo, so they they got lots and lots of time to get lots and lots of feedback, folks. So definitely, if you do play the demo, um, go ahead and join the Games Incubators uh, Discord. I do not have the link for it down below, um, but it is on the Steam page, so you can follow the, the links I have in the description for the Steam page there. Get yourself there. Get yourself hooked up woo, to the Discord. You know what? Let's do something a little different this time. Um, but yeah, so get yourself in there, give them your feedback in that, so that way this game can, uh, if it's something that you're interested in, uh, can be uh, well worth playing. So there we go. Woo -hoo! Woo! 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 So this reminds me a lot of the um, the original house flipper neighborhoods in that too, especially with that red car down there. You guys seen that red car? That red car was in uh, the house flipper, the original. Oh man. 
Can I trash myself? No, I can't get trashed. <laughs> no drinking in this game. But yeah, otherwise, I mean, pretty cool looking neighborhood. I do like what they've done for the background, even though the playable area is pretty small. Once again, this is just the demos play tests. So let me just go turn that light back on one sec. Okay. Uh, all right. <laughs> I was able to reach it and hit that light just once this time. No, I can't wait for my brother to get home. <laughs> I'm going to be setting up that new, the two new lights in a heartbeat. Oh. So in order to finish, just go into your menu, click on the order, click on the finish. And there we go. So that is it. So they do have a questionnaire and you can also uh, head on over to the Steam page from here as well. But uh, yeah, yeah so it's, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Um, I like what they've done so far with it. I do hope that the demo has... Um, at least two houses into it. Uh, this is, you know, pretty quick. I mean, if we can do it in 20 minutes. Um, yeah. Uh, the exclamation discord, Killing Beans. Exclamation discord. Speaking of which, how is your fibro doing, dude? You yeah, hope it's not, uh, not bugging you. Flare-ups suck. There we go. That should that should pop the Steam Labs. If Steam Labs is in today, it should be. Come on, Steam Lab. There we go. <laughs> but yeah, so oh well, that I was kind of expecting the game to be a little bit longer. But uh, yeah, I guess it's going to be a quick and easy one for me, which is fine. It gives me time to to go have a nice long hot shower and scream as I try to wash my hair. <laughs> But you guys are all awesome. Thank you so much for being here. Like I said, go click the link down in the description below. Get yourself to the Steam page. Download the demo if you're interested in playing it. Get the feel for this particular game. I like it. Uh, I, I see there is a lot of potential in here. There's you know quite a few things that do need to uh, be given to the developers for feedback. But uh, they won't know unless we speak our minds. So you guys are all awesome and amazing thank you so very much to both shane and jack the reaper for the gift memberships and for reap for the uh for the new keyboard so you guys missed the uh, mail earlier today i i, I got myself a new a new keyboard to uh, replace the one that caveman spilt a slurpee on this weekend so thank you very very much my man greatly appreciate that huge huge favors so as always, no matter where you are in the world today, guys, I hope you have yourselves a wonderful morning, evening, afternoon, good night. Special thanks to the heroes of our channel. We got Any64, Devin, Shane, Spider at William, Little Mac, Karsten, Indigo, Jack, Ebuzz, Lean, Eden, William, Bud, Renee, Chris, Noah. Uh oh, I ran out. Uh oh, I missed it. I missed it. And did Karsten just come in with 25 months? Look at that! So, all right, so Bud, Renee, Chris, Noah, Douglas, Split and Two, Malachi, Pennington, or, or, uh, To Be Happy, Froggy, John, Riggs, Michael, Aiden, as well as welcome to the newest of the members. We got ourselves Osney, Viddy, uh, Beshaden. I'm just like I said, I'm gonna call Beatrix, uh, Litzen, uh, William Lai, Lau, Lai, Lay. Not sure how to pronounce the last name on that, but uh, we also have uh, Derek. Hey, man, that's awesome. Good to see you into the memberships, my man. We got Demonic, Joshua, OK Basta, Abigail, Jesse, uh, Angie, just a girl who loves film. Love that name. Lee and Mandy Battersby, uh, two times Hunts, Salvador Corbin or Cobain, CX5, Trishna, Wahoo, Timeless Boss, Govind, Stolshaw, Ulta. Song and Martin. So thank you very much. Welcome to the channel, guys. I hope everybody has themselves a fantastic day today. Um, we'll be back again tomorrow. Tomorrow is Thursday, so it's going to be Landlord Super. We're bringing that back in. As I said, we want to do Attendance Thursday, so let's bring it back. Let's do it. So I'll see everybody then tomorrow. Same time, same channel. As always, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Hope you had the time to kick back, relax, unwind. And I'll see you in the next episode. Later! Peace, y'all. Thanks for the quick stream.